this video I like to talk about the idea of helping the poor, well, probably also known as social policy and the needy. So beginning with, I guess you could consider it welfare as we knew it, or early welfare. Um, well, the Social Security Act of 1935, really a lot of benefits towards Americans, especially coming at the end of the Great Depression. Um, Social Security Act of 1935, of course, established Social Security, um, those payments for older age individuals, but also at the same time, it created some benefits for families with children who were poor and did not have a lot of money. So, you know, they got some benefits later on during um, LBJ's The Great Society in the United States. There was more aid towards families, such as food stamps and such, um, during that war on poverty. But really, you know, in the 1980s and even into the 1990s, a lot of people claiming benefits from welfare and such. Um, you know, there's a lot of things that were not working so well in the system. So, in 1996, there was welfare reform, um, headed by Bill Clinton. Of course, in his 1992 election, he this was one key aspect of his platform was the reform of welfare. But he did pass this in 1996. Of course, he was a Democrat and he sided with a lot of Republicans on this one. The Democrats really had an issue with this. And it was the Personal Responsibility and Work Opportunity Reconciliation Act. Basically, it limited states to a set amount of money for welfare and basically said for everyone who is to be on welfare, they basically have to get a job within two years or they lose their benefits. At the same time, every person can only be on welfare for five years in their life. And something which also did change is, you know, during LBJ's Great Society and such, having all that welfare for children um, and families that were lower income, well, now there's temporary assistance for needy families, which basically was reformed in this act and basically cut a lot of benefits towards people. And basically you have to have, um, a lot of families nowadays just use food stamps rather than welfare because the amount of money that can go into welfare has dropped a ton and, you know, welfare isn't being used by a lot of people in the United States anymore as a result of this reform. And you can, if you just take a look at it, um, charts of basically food stamps versus welfare, you can see um, food stamps is still kind of high, but welfare just right after this act in 1996 dropped off quite heavily.